Today we're going to be discussing the five top most expensive houses sold in Las Vegas in 2023 and I have your list right here. The number five most expensive home sold here in Las Vegas is in the Sky Summit community. It sold in July for $15.5 million. It's seven bedrooms, three bathrooms, and it's 8,936 square feet with a 34,848 square foot lot. Number four is located in the Ridges right here in Las Vegas. And it was located, it's located on Painted Feather Way. It sold for $15.9 million with five bedrooms, four bathrooms, four half bathrooms, with 10,843 square foot of living space and the lot size is 64,000 square feet. So nice yard. If you live here in Vegas, you know that yards are pretty much small. They're average between five to 8,000 square feet. So that's a huge yard, plenty of room. Number three is located in the summit of Summerlin on Discovery Canyon Drive. This is a nine bedroom six bathroom with 8,419 square foot of living space and a 28,314 square foot lot. Now, number two is probably the largest home sold right here in Las Vegas. And this is located in Spanish Trails and it's sold for $25 million. Now this home is something special. It has four guest bedrooms, a studio pavilion, a caretaker's residence, a pool house, which is just as large as the primary house. Um, and it also has a carriage house and a tennis court and a massive yard. This is 25 bedrooms, 28 full bathrooms, 107,597 square foot of living space and 692,604 square foot lot. Could you imagine? And the number one most expensive house sold in 2023 is of course Celine Dion's house. We don't have too much information on it because it's not a public sale. It was never listed in the MLS but it is, a, it sold for $30 million and she purchased it for 17 million. So she made a nice pretty penny off of it. It's only a four bedroom and it's nine and a half bathrooms, but it's 30,000 square foot of living space. So it's nice and spacious. The lot size itself, we really don't know how big it is because there's no public information on it, but she actually lived there for many, many years and it was her primary residence. So it's a beautiful, I'm sure that the house is beautiful. Unfortunately, we're not able to see what it looks like on the inside. I wish we could, but stay tuned for more and follow me for everything Las Vegas.